Well, we're back off to the auction again. Um, will we get anything this time? Here's hoping, Han. Hi everyone, um, yes it's auction day, we're very excited um, and I know what a lot of you are thinking, you're thinking, whoa, 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 what happened to the items from the last auction? Surely you're going to let us know about that and yes we are, we're going to put in in the video insert a little clip here so that you can sort of see how we got on with those items that got listed from the last auction. So in the last auction the lot that we bought had seven items in it um, they cost £2.16 each and we're going to take you through what was sold so far. So in the video we'd bought them on the 18th of January. Um, everything was listed either that day or the next day because there were only seven sort of listings. So that's why we managed to get them done so quick. So that was good. Um, the African hand carved man sculpture. That's not the wording from the... Um, from the actual listing but that went up for 19.99 and sold for 17.99 and that sold on the 20th um within the week the tulips and sweet peas picture these went up for 28.99 and guess what we we're very pleased because they went for full price the two dog pictures they were they started at 22.99 each um, and we were quite lucky there, even though they went in the sale, one person bought both of them, so we did save on one lot of postage. So they went for £33.98. Um, the Titchfield um, watercolours, which unfortunately we can't show you because it never actually got to the photo area because our daughter had shown an interest and she did actually keep them. So out of the seven listings, three have sold so far. Emily's kept um, a pair of them and we've got three left to sell. We're off on our way to this auction. I had a look last night, I spent about an hour um, going through the 600 odd lots that they've got. Um, oh, I'm a little bit kinky there, my love. <laughs> Perhaps I should have used a different word. A little, it's a kinky. Yeah, what's happened there? I don't know, I'm, not, I'm a little bit wonky. Um, 600 lots, I'll carry on, hun, because I'm professional. <laughs> 600 lots. Now I've got I've got a list here. I've gone through and I've got about 35 that I'm interested in. They're not I'm not interested in buying 35, but there's some there that I thought you might want to have a look at. So um, I'd like to show them in the video things of interest. I've got about 14 that I looked at for Paul. Um, they're mainly cameras, um, games, that sort of thing, electrical items that he might be interested in. So well, we're heading there now. We heading, heading there, there now, now, aren't we, yeah, hun? We are. Um, good. It's, a, it's a rainy day, oh, unfortunately. Itchy nose. It's very, very wet, and um, so hopefully you can hear us okay. Um, it's miserable, isn't it? it is miserable, miserable day. There's nothing I do about the weather, unfortunately. <laughs> no, and we've got quite a busy day planned, and we've got a lot of listing to do. Yep. Um, so, oh, bit of a shot of the ceiling there, huh? Yeah, Look at that. If you, Arty. If you move your hand a bit. Arty, that is. Oh, that was quite close <laughs> to my double chin then, huh? But then one, we'll gloss over that. Yeah. Yes, we've got quite a busy day, so um, I don't think there's going to be room for a planning meeting today, which has made me a little bit grumpy. We'll have to just make a coffee when we get home, yeah, hun. Yeah. But, um, you know, this is how it is. Sometimes you just can't always be off enjoying yourself. So we're going to go to the auction, have a look round. Um, but I'm going to be honest, out of all these 600 lots I've looked at, there's nothing really that I'm like, wow, I can't wait to show you that, hun. I can't wait to yeah, look at it. Yeah. There is a Marilyn Monroe lot um, of books and things like that, memorabilia, which I've had a quick look at online to see because we, in the past, we did buy a Lauren Hardy collection of items we and that did. went really that well, went didn't really it? really well, yeah. We Learned a lot, lot about that and how popular mm -hmm. they are. So, um, so yeah, out of all the lots, that's probably the one I'm most interested in. Um, but it depends on how many books are there. I know there's a few DVDs there. Yeah. So, um, so yeah, I'm going to swing the camera around now and we'll do some footage of us hot-footing it to the auction hunt, shall yeah. we? Let's Woo! see how fast I can go. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Some... Oh, God, it? it is. It's just... 
That's nice. Mm. It's a lot just coins, aren't they? Yeah. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Nice, aren't they? Oh, yeah. Mm, lovely. It's a nice pile of stuff, this time, right? Yeah, haven't they? Yeah. It's cool. Those <laughs> are pictures, Mary. Are you interested? <laughs> I've got them down, yeah. Oh, have you? Yeah, I know. I'm going to leave you with, uh, with that. This is two, four, three. I've written it down because it's got Pelham puppets with it. All right. Where are the Pelham puppets? <laughs> are they under here? Is that part of it? Oh, there's a channel under there, it's all, um... Okay. Quite nice, though. Sort of thing. It's a bottom tray. Mm. You can see that things like this are damaged. Yeah, I know, you're going to have damage, aren't you? But, um, no pain puppets. No. Yeah. It's a lot of work, isn't it? Depends what it goes for, really, isn't it? Yeah. Not nice. Maybe some good ones. But that one, though, has been glued in three places there. That's the problem. You never know. They always, yeah, but they always go for really strong money, don't they? Yeah, we'll see. Oh, there's a pair of puppets. What are they doing over here? Yeah. Two, four, eight. Hmm. What have you got written down then? Two, four, eight. I wonder if I was looking at two, five, eight. <laughs> <laughs> I was being a bit dyslexic with my numbers. Oh. I think we've had this blonde one before. Okay. Box is bad, don't it? What's the other one? Yeah. One's sealed, or oh, not sealed, but it's in a encased box. Isn't it? Caterpillar, it says that you just put that down. Oh, I've not seen that one before. No, that's nice. It's different, isn't it? Isn't it? Yeah. Okay. They go for good money, though, the pen and puppets, don't they? Yeah. So there's two, what else is in there? No markings. Cold pork. Tika. to have one of them. Wow. For over 60 years, Look at 
the avocado. <laughs> Oh, no. <laughs> it's gorgeous, isn't it? The little figures, nice. But it goes with that big thing there. And, uh... oh, right. Look at that, look. I used to sell cellar tape in a tin. Wow. <laughs> oh, there's a lot in there, one, two. Look at the roses, look. Honest, I'm not really interested in scary dolls. <laughs> no, not too bad. We've had that before. Some more of these biscuit ones, aren't they? No. Put it down these clouds, but I had no idea those were big. Oh, right. I'm not a big fan of clowns, but they're not too bad, are they, as long as you don't have them facing you. <laughs> yeah. Alfa Romeo seats, look at that. Aren't they gorgeous? They're cool, aren't they? They are cool. Oh, that's your scary ice cream. <laughs> 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 it's menacing looking, isn't it? <laughs> Oh, thank you. This is nice, though. Here the end of the, the lesson. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that, though. They don't make them like that anymore, do they? I don't. Yeah. I'm going to put this one down. I'm not realising it's so large. That's that as well, isn't it? Yeah. They're, they're a bit, still, aren't they? Yeah, a bit big. They are lovely. Yeah. Cool, yeah, lots of them. I mean, and there's some red notes day stuff as well. Um, 2007. Oh, how can you put a price on it though? You've got no idea what. Um, I think all you can do is, is guesstimate. Yeah. So it's those two boxes there. Is it those as well? Is it 160? With red noses, but there's three red noses there. Oh, three. Oh. Yeah. Look at the old matches there. Huh. But then you've got these as well. There's quite a few in there. Is it these the whole, like, the whole um, shelf? Doodars, aren't they? Cards. But then more. a lot of work but mm. Mm. good bundle is it these as well yeah it's the whole shelf probably Lloyd Loon chair but I wanted to see what it came with I was 510 isn't it 510 yeah Lloyd Loon chair but it's a nest of tables. Like a blast in the past, isn't it? It is. That's that lovely. is nice, yeah. So we've got a nest of tables. Oh, look. Look at all that, look. Wow. That's nice, isn't it? It's a lot of old games and so books. It says 590. Do you Is think that that's all? that whole... Oh, oh no, different. 590. Oh, so the books are different. So it's all of these. So there's two shelves, isn't it? Three, Three shelves. shelves. Look. look at the girls' world. I had that. <sighs> Blimey. Oh. oh, it's difficult, isn't it? I didn't even write this one down because I... I thought it'd just be a load of stuff with lots missing, but oh, wouldn't it be great to go for all that? You do like a rummage, don't I you? I love a rummage. 
Well, not only that, the ukulele boxes are sopping wet, so it just makes you... Why yeah. would you put good stuff outside, though? How long's it been out here? Could have been out here for a month. Which is good, yeah, all that feels wet and damp. Why would you yeah, put it out here? Well, then, obviously not worth a lot. <laughs> well, I said it wouldn't be out here, yeah. would But I bet it'll go for good money. I'm going to have to write it down, hon. Okay. Oh, see, that is wet. Look at that. That is yeah. sopping. What a shame. All this vintage stuff. It's, it's getting damaged. What am I busy? I'm writing it down, hon. <laughs> <laughs> These shelves tat. <laughs> I'm going to put that girl's world down. Blast from the past there, look. Yeah, this is my wicker. heart. I wrote it down just because it said wicker. Oh. Look at that. It's quite a nice yeah, sort of wicker chest, that's... that really, isn't it? Yeah, look at that as well. Is that candle holders? I don't know. I bet they look like for big... I don't know, because it's got like the... Um... Oh, I don't, I don't know. know. It's like they're extendable, aren't they? Yeah, there's a few in there. Cool. Oh. There's not many items, but what is there is nice. Let me yeah. swing that round and see what that's like. Oh, what a place for it to be damaged, look. Yeah, and the back as well, look. Yeah. But you don't get many wicker chests like that. That's gorgeous. Gorgeous. But what a shame. Yeah. It is a shame. Oh, see, that feels damp as well. We're going to have to hand sand when we get back to the van. <laughs> hand sand in the van. Yeah. <laughs> it's proper icky. Oh, I do like that though, honey, even though it's damaged. That's oh, no. lovely. Look That's at cool, that. That is gorgeous. Is this oh. what you expect to find in a wicker basket? Plastic bulbs. Plastic bulbs. Really Ikea do, though, they? Ikea. Yeah. So what's that, 542? What else did you get with it? Mm. I'm assuming it's all of this. Mm -hmm. It's all wet. Yeah, is it this as well then? Mm. I would assume so. I have to have a look oh, on no, it. So it is, yeah. So it's all um, like bats. Brackets. <laughs> bats. <laughs> <laughs> That's us done looking round. Pretty cold now, wasn't it? Was it? <laughs> We've chosen a really, really miserable day. It's, yeah. it's that really fine rain that soaks you through. Yeah, it's, it's just it's, miserable, isn't it? Yeah, just walking to the door. It and was, it's um, it's cold in the place, isn't it? Yeah. But I'm more enthusiastic now. I now I've been because yeah. there was some lovely lots there. Three that I'm really interested in: the, the Marilyn Monroe stuff. Um, there was twelve books, about fourteen. Um, calendars some a coin set some dvds some pictures some tins so um yes i'm interested in that there was a advertising tins lot with at least 50 yeah that looked in. quite cool that did didn't that's it? gonna go for good money but yeah, I, it probably will really do nice. but it's, it's the same it might be some value there and then i think there was seven box well, there's seven boxes of pin badges wasn't there mm. and cards and all sorts a lot of sorting out but a again lot of work, but if if it's worth it, you know, as yeah, in value-wise, there's a potentially a lot there for your money. I wasn't um, interested, but now I am. So there's lots yeah. of other stuff. I've looked at copious amounts of pictures, hun. Yeah. Um, I don't think I've actually been that interested in any of the picture lots, even though I have checked them all after last after the last time. We've yeah, I'm, I'm glad to be honest with you. I was yeah. looking at some of the um, pictures you were looking at, and I was Massive. thinking, oh, <laughs> all, all I'm thinking is how am I shipping that? <laughs> but we've looked at Cindy stuff, haven't we, and things like that. Um, we've got quite a lot of research to do now. We've got some taken notes, got a yeah. couple of pages of notes, and um, all the electrical stuff we've written down. We've Product written down codes. bits and bobs, yeah. I'm, I, I wouldn't say there's anything really there I'm excited about. No. Um, but, uh, but yeah, we'll see. See how it goes. Obviously, if things go cheap enough, then... Um, we're always interested, aren't we? That's cheap oh, enough. Yeah, of course we are. Always, <laughs> always interested. Saw a lovely Lloyd Loom chair, didn't we? But yes, to get we that, do. you've got to get three or four other pieces other of things, furniture, which uh, can be a bit of a pain. Tables and there, yeah. and uh, yeah. Saw a few so. bits of wicker as well, which is interesting. But mm. um, yeah, lots there to sort of um, 
ponder, really. Yeah. But now we're going to go home and have a drink, can't we? And we then, are, um, yeah. We're going to have a go. Go and have a coffee. Go and have a coffee. And Warm um, up. I'll have a little look at what we're discounting and what we're going to do a bit of research on. Yeah. So uh, I think the next is the um, them going under the hammer, isn't it? Yes, on Monday. Ooh, oh, exciting. Yeah. It's Sunday and it's the day before the auction. Woo! Ooh. So we thought we'd go through um, some of the bits we we're proposing and bidding on, didn't we? Yes, out of these six hundred over six hundred lots at this auction, we've whittled it down. We went to the auction, we've whittled it down even more. We've done some research, and these are the. I think we've got a twelve. Lot of, here. A lot of whittling. A lot of whittling. Mm. We've got twelve here, hun, that we're sort of interested in. We're yeah. going to take you through. Yeah. And then we can play them before the um, auction bidding and, and then you can have show a laugh. You, yes, <laughs> and see what we don't get. <laughs> yeah. And see how you know our prices are completely out. Yeah. So let's start with this 131 hun. Oh, bamboo coat hook. I love this. Yeah. It's only had got three items in the um the lot, but I have done some research on the coat hook and even though I haven't seen the exact one, smaller ones go for about 150-ish. I think I could put this up for 200, this coat hook. It's gorgeous. Um, so the only downside is you're lumbered with the other two items, which are yeah, big and heavy yeah. and I and don't necessarily want. No, so I'm, I'm being a bit strict. I'm going to bid um, £44. Now, these prices we're giving you are... Um, without the fees, which roughly yes, equate to about 32%. But so, around about that, yeah. But this is what we're actually going to bid and then... You know, that will yeah. be added on to it. So 44, I've waffled on, £44, yeah. Hans, what I'm bidding for these three things. Excellent. One, three, one. Oak display cabinet, etc. there. Ten of there online. Is there 12? 12 there. 14 there. 18 there. 20 there. 24 there. 26 there. 30 there now. 32. 40 there now. 42, 44, 46 there now, 48, 46 there then, and away, so 48 now anywhere else, 48 back in the room, is there 50, there is, there 55, 55, is there 60, there is, 65, 60 then online, selling it away. This is lot 150. It's the box of Marilyn Monroe items. When we were at the auction, I thought there was about 43 items. I'm looking at about a pound, a pound an item to be sort of safe. Hmm. But I am sort of prepared to go up for about 50 pounds. There's something with this this lot. I don't know what it is, but I'm going to bid 50 pounds. and then You have a feeling. Uh, that fimbly feeling, hun, <laughs> and see how we get on. 150, point of your Marilyn Monroe, memorabilia, etc. 34, 38 there online, 40 there online, 42 there now, 44, 46, 46 there is there, 48, 46 then, and away. So next up, we've got some Celestian speakers. Yes, this is a lot 154. We did have a quick look online, didn't we? We did, Because we yeah. thought they were the same speakers that were in the last auction because there was a lot in the last auction with two other big things that, that mm. add value and we thought oh that person's put them back in again but it, they weren't the same were they no they slightly weren't slightly different model different model slightly different size we googled them and if if they're working 170 pounds well this is the thing though with auctions you just, hun, isn't you just it? don't you know, just if they're don't working, know do you? and you didn't You'd always have that sort of vibe where I'll sort of see how I feel on the day mm. um, because it depends on who else is bidding. That's it. And, um, you, you know, you don't want to risk a lot of money because they could just be a couple of nice-looking speakers and not actually be working. Yeah. 154, pair of vintage speakers there, Celestian speakers there, 20 there online. Is there 22? 22, 24, 30, 34 online, 36, 36, 38, 40. 42, 42, 44, 42 then standing this side, selling it away. So we've got lot 160 is our next one, hun. I really wanted these, these seven boxes of pins. Now this is the thing with it, they, they're they small, aren't they? So they look like they were jam-packed with pins, but they also had like, cigarette cards and things like that. There was no, a I don't whole know, shelf, wasn't there? A whole shelf, I don't know anything about them. 
Um, but they did have a guide price of 50 to 80. So I don't think I'm going to get them, hun. I think they're going to be too rich for me. But I am being brave and I'm going to bid £10 a box. Oh, well, we're just going to say £10 in total no, then. No. I'm going to go £10 a box and I hope that gets it. But I've got that feeling that I'm not going to come away with it. And, and sometimes you have to look at it and think, OK, if I don't get it, it's a lot. looks like a lot of work on something yeah. that I know nothing about. Yeah. So I'm going to leave it in the lap of the gods and see how it, see how it goes. 160, shelf, including pin badges, cigarette cards, max box covers, etc. 75 there to start me online. Is there 80? 80 there online. 80 there online. 85 anywhere else. This is lot 184 and it's some large clowns. I was a little bit apprehensive about this. Not a massive fan of clowns. No, um, me and we only, because they were up high, we only saw one of them that had like a name on the back of it and you took a photo, didn't you? Yeah. yeah. As we were coming back down the stairs, we saw that and we Googled it and that one was worth quite a bit of money. But I think they're, we didn't look at the others and you don't know whether they're chipped or cracked That's or broken the thing. Or it's the same thing with the auction. You can't, you can't study it thoroughly. And we'd already use. come away, so yeah. it's like we don't know now. So we're going to bid £40, in, in, but I think they're quite nice. They're quite large. Yeah. I think they're going to go for good money. 184, various model clowns, etc. Straight on it, £40. 40 me, is there 42? 40 me, 42. I've got 44, 46, 48 with me. Is there 50? I've got 55, 60. Is there 65? 65 then, back in the room. Is there 70 now anywhere else? 65 to the room. Next up, we've got this ion turntable. Yes, this is lot 255. Now, when we're at the auction, um, Paul has a certain way of doing it. I have a certain way of doing mm -hmm. it. Paul's way is right down cheap next to it. Yes. Which and normally means, means it's a tenner. That's it. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. <laughs> that's don't, your go code, much, don't go much it? more than that. But this will be interesting because you can watch um, when we put the live footage in. Will he bid more than £10? That's going to be the interesting thing, huh? Mm. How, mu how much clicking have you done? <laughs> All right, 255. Here's the turntable there. Various electrical equipment. Again, £10 note, surely. 10 are there. 12 there. 14. 16. Nope. 14 in the room at the moment. Is there 16 online? 14 to the room. Then we have lot 291. Now, this was some cameras. I think there were some lenses, hun. But on the day, um, when we were walking around, we wrote down a Praktika and an Olympus camera. So yeah. we wrote the codes down. So I did Google those two, and they had like a sale valued combined of £80. But we didn't write every single we thing down. We didn't know, so, so that... there's more value there. Yeah, um, but it's but how much really do you... Know. Yeah, and you don't really know the know condition, so that's the difficult thing. So you normally sort of get a vibe, don't you, and you sort of that's see. It. Yeah. So I think that's what you'll be doing, won't you? Oh, yes. See what it... See, see, what what you... go. <laughs> see how it goes. Yeah. <laughs> right, turn on one, select the cameras, etc. Straight to me, it's £60. 60 with me, is there 65? 65 online, I'm out. Is there 70? 65 there, then. This next lot is uh, Yamaha Receiver. Yes, it's lot 307. I think there's some other bits and pieces with it, but mm. we, we noted down the receiver um, over the weekend. I've had a look, and if it's if it works and it's in good condition, you're looking at about 125 in solds. Okay. So, so that's, that's um, pretty good, so it's yeah. definitely worth worth going for. So we always look at that, don't we, before the auction, and then Paul yeah. will have a rough idea of sort of what he wants to spend. You never divulge it, do you, because you sort of do it at the time. Um, <laughs> yeah, it's, how, it's, it's the feeling, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, the feeling the of feeling. who else is bidding as well, because sometimes it's very easy to get carried away, and some if you've got a few people bidding, yeah. you sort of know you're not going to get it early doors, don't you? So That's it. Good luck, hun. Thank you. Uh, throw some then. Yamaha keyboard, receiver, etc. 24 there online, is there 26? 24 there then, 26 there now, is there 28? 30. 28 there then. This is lot 309 and it's some vintage um, like leather skates. Um, when we went to the auction and had a look round, they had some brass items as well. So I sort of mm. thought, oh, quite like this one. It was only one, one sort of tray box, but I'm sort of going to go 20 pound hun. Um, cool. And see how we get on. Uh, throw night, a box of vintage ice skates, brass wear, etc. 10 there, I've got 12, 14, 16, 18 with me. 
20 with me. 22 with me. 24 with me. I've got 26. I've got 28 with me. 30 there on line. I'm out. Is there 32? This is lot 358, and I think it was, was it two boxes of advertising tins? Yes. And I do love old things, Hal. Mm. I really want this lot. They did look cool. Um, we tried to count them up, but there was too many. They were all mm. on top of each other. You couldn't you couldn't get an idea of it. But I'm sort of going to bid 50, but I think they're going to go for more than that. And I'm, if they do, I'm going to be really disappointed because I really <laughs> want these. Um, but you can only sort of judge it on what you think you're going to get back, and it's a risk when you buy an auction. So... Fifty pounds. Let's keep our fingers crossed. We have eight selection of fifty and sixty advertising, Cadbury, etc. Dare to find any cleaner boxes than these. Fifty-five online. Fifty-five there now. Is there sixty? Sixty back in the room. Is there sixty-five? Seventy. Seventy-five. Eighty. Eighty-five. Eighty then in the room. This is lot 542, and I've just written down bamboo picnic basket because out of it's a general load of tat. But oh, the yeah, one, that's it. The that's one the lovely want, thing there is the <laughs> picnic basket, which is like an old um, wicker vintage bamboo one. Um, but what can you say, hon? It's whether anyone else sees any other value, but there's all sorts of things that I don't want, like um, tennis rackets and things like that. Yeah. But I'm going to bid 20 in the hope that I get the picnic basket and I can make something out of the other stuff. Mm. 542, selection sport and equipment. 10 are there online, is there 12? 10 are there online then. Now this is the last lot, this is lot 590. Now to be honest with you, we don't really want this lot because this is the outside lot, all those boxes, they had the odd mm. bit of Star, Star Wars or and then they had some action men listed, they had a girl's this. world. It's yeah. outside. When we touched the paper, they were wet, and, they? and the books, they were they were wet, mm. um, which leads us to believe they've been out there getting weathered, and some of the stuff might not be sellable. Mm. But when you have a big lot like that, and you put down lots of vintage things like Action Men and Girls World, and they always go for really good money. So we thought we'd show you this one because I'm gonna I'm gonna bid twenty, but I think that whoosh that will soon go by, um, and. I'm going to say, hun, over £100. Even though it's stuck outside, I think that's going to go for over, over £100. So we'll yeah. see, shall we? Yeah, let's have a look. 590. Sex and vintage toys and games. A lot there. 26 there online. Is there 28? 28. 30 in the room. 32, 34, 36 is gone to. 38. 38. 40. 42. 44. 46. 48 it is now. Is there 50? 50 back in the room. Is there 55? 60? 65? 70? 75? 80? 85? 90? 95? 100? 110? 120? 120 back in the room. Is there 130? 140? 150? 140 then in the room, selling it away. Auction collection day. Ooh, very excited. Mm. Didn't get a lot of sleep though, hon. I always get it on auction collection day. I always get a little bit excited. Can't wait to see what's there. I'm like a kid at Christmas. Yeah. So I'm a little bit weary now, a little bit tired. By about two o'clock, I'll be asleep. <laughs> <laughs> Hope not. Got lots of work planned today. I've written down what we bought, hon. We, we actually won some things yes, this time. Yes, we did. So we've got the, the Marilyn Monroe lot. That's lot 150, we, where we bid £46. With fees, which have gone up slightly, haven't they? Only very slightly. It's, Can we just talk about the fees, though, hon? Because yeah. I always say about 30%. It's just gone up to 32%, but it's not just the auction house, is it? Just no, explain no, no. it, because okay. I, I don't want to mislead anyone. <laughs> we use um, a website, uh, The Sale Room, <clears throat> to do our bidding. Mm. And um, obviously, if you're at the auction house bidding in person, it would be a bit cheaper. Um, so they charge a percentage as well on top of... Um, the auction house yeah and this is where our sort of 30 percent uh, comes from because that's also including the VAT on the fees um, so the, I believe well, what is the actual auction house was it 20 percent I think it's 22 percent now 22 percent something just like gone that up in February. and then of course you've got VAT on their fees mm. on the 22 percent um, and then um, the sale room 
um, charge um, uh, 6%, I believe, 5 Something like that, something yeah. Something like around about that sort of percentage. Um, and then plus VAT again. So, of course, um, that, that's where we get our... Um, 30 we add it all up from, don't we add it all yes, up yes we yeah so, so it. this so it, it, this that's month how it works out it's about 32 percent now because they've just increased. There, it has price. increased very slightly so overall including vat and everything on the on the fees it works out about 32 percent um because yeah. I, I know um it's, it probably sounds quite expensive yeah that's um, why we wanted I to think clarify it is, really yeah, because it's probably, we don't really, i haven't really explained it in the past and everyone must be thinking oh my goodness me 30 percent yeah it's not necessarily the, the auction house it's yes the auction combined. house is around uh 20 plus vat but um it's all combined yeah because we're at home bidding and not um in actually the <laughs> in the warm yeah that's it with our lunch and yeah coffee. so of course <laughs> you have to pay for that so um <laughs> yeah so there is a percentage um that the sale room is the sale room.com they deal with a lot of auction houses and um, they charge a percentage um for that service and we love using it don't we it's easy yeah yeah it's clear mm. so yes it is, so, it is, it is. and that you you've got everything displayed what lots you've won all the prices everything yeah so it, it's it's quite easy to to use so so yeah. thank you for that. I love you explained oh, that perfectly. Uh, okay, thank perfectly. you. Perfectly. Thank you, dear. So we bid forty six pounds, but with the thirty two percent fees all in, it is sixty pounds and seventy two p. So that's what we've paid for that box of Marilyn Monroe stuff. So fingers crossed. There was a box of coins in there that we um, saw at the auction that we googled, and it was worth about fifty pound. Mm. But it's whether that box of coins is still there because this is the risk you run when you're buying from <laughs> auction. Just because it was there when you looked, is it still there? <laughs> Sometimes people go there and there's a little bit of pilfering. We don't. We've never well, had it. Well, we? no, 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 no. Yeah, we've never we, had we, it. We, we've never had it, but um, but it, it's very easy to do. Put yes. it that way. So you have to be a little, little bit, bit careful. A little bit careful. So yeah. you won a, a Yamaha receiver, didn't you? You bid yes. twenty eight pounds. This is lot three hundred seven, and with all the fees, thirty six ninety six. Yep. So that's so, enough for you to work again, on. Well, yep, it is. You. Yep. Lucky me. Fingers crossed. And then I bought some vintage skates, vintage leather skates. I know, pretty random. Mm. That was lot 309, but there was also some brassware in there, and there's something we've had leather skates before, and they've done all right. They have done well, yeah. It's, it depends on the state of them, really. state of the skates. <laughs> state of the skates, that's it, yeah. <laughs> we bid 30, so with the fees, £39.60 yeah. is what we've paid. Yeah, we'll see. And then I went a little bit rogue with a oh, fell in love with a wicker basket, a wicker picnic basket, which I don't think oh. you saw in the picture. Where's your badge? Where's your I know, I don't got a wicker woman badge. <laughs> Um, it was lot 542. The items were outside, which I've never a fan of when they've been outside and weathered. Um, well, when they say they're outside, they're undercover, um, yeah. but um, open obviously to the open to the elements because all the yeah. front, all the side is open, so you obviously people can walk in. Mm -hmm. So they are they're undercover, but obviously where they could can get in. Um, yeah, so, um, so yeah, we, we're never, never a huge fan of that. No, but the but picnic basket was there, and, our, you know, yeah, and we yeah. were lucky. We Wicker. got it for ten pound. So Wicker, wasn't it? <laughs> it was, we, go, do, 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 do. we got it with the fees thirteen pound twenty. So, mm. um, although I wanted the basket, it's also come with things like sporting goods, like old yeah, tennis yeah. rackets and things like that. So yeah, it's, it's got it's got some random stuff in there. Hopefully, I think, there's so. something there we can make money on. Yeah. But what did you think about the? Um, the lot outside, do you remember before the auction, I sort of said to you, I think that's going to go for over £100. Yeah. It was damp. The, a lot of the packaging was damp yeah. and wet. Mm. And I think we bid something like £20 or something. So, something like that. <laughs> we, we were never going to get it. Well, no, we weren't. Of course we weren't. But you, you, you have to put these bids in because sometimes yeah. there is the odd um, moment yeah. sometimes that you do actually win yeah. that sort of thing and yeah. um you know but so you have to put a cheeky bid in mm. but you know we when we looked at it we thought oh, it went for over 100 didn't it was it, it 120 was, it was some, 130 100, something like that i think something like that it was only yesterday it was, but we're quite forgetful yeah we are very, so we're um, getting old <laughs> yes yeah, so i'm hoping the person that got that lot did get some gems because we didn't i'm sure there would was, have been there's a lot of stuff there so i'm sure there would have been some gems in there yeah and i don't know if anyone else is the same when you're when you're at an auction and you're looking at some of the stuff sometimes you feel a little bit don't you a bit funny going through the box because you're like oh i need some hand sanitizer <laughs> it makes you feel Gloves. especially where it had been outside you don't want to put your hands in sometimes yeah so i'm hoping that whoever got that lot got some bargains but mm. um yeah it was a shelf two shelves full of stuff wasn't it yeah had that girl's world head
So anyway, yes. back to us. We've spent one hundred and fifty pounds and forty eight pence. Is it forty eight or ninety three? Oh, is it? is it? Have I added it up wrong? That's all right. How rare it's for a rare. Me to get my It was one hundred and fifty pounds <laughs> and something. <laughs> yes, one hundred and fifty ish. One hundred and fifty ish. Yeah. <laughs> I've looked at the invoice. I just tried yeah, to do yeah. it myself, which was a disaster written all over it. Uh, yeah. Um, and we're Fract just it's fractionally different. We're just going to go now and pick it up. We're a bit giddy because um. As ABL says, a bit giddy, a bit giddy. Um, because I love going and picking up stuff because you just don't know what you've bought, do you? Yeah. Until you get it home and have a look. And um, and it, it, what have we done? What have we done? How it, much have we spent? Yeah, but we'll we're, we're doing this new thing where we are listing it straight away. So we're the, dealing with it straight the away. The Marilyn Monroe it. stuff will be listed today. I won't be going to bed until that's done, and then <laughs> I'm going to spend the time tomorrow doing the vintage skates and the picnic basket lot. Yeah. So that's going to be a long day, I think, hon. Yes, it is going to be a long day. So should we... Um, Let's go. Quick, quicker think... we go, the quicker we can get back and have a coffee. Yes. <laughs> okay, here we are, we're back. The weather's turned a bit, hon. It's got cold. It has a bit. It's cold. raining, which yeah. means my hair's gone frizzy. But we're going to gloss over that. We've made... Don't, don't show me too close, hon. The wrinkles. We're going to show you what we've got. We've just got home. We, mm. um, we thought we'd best do this before we go and get that coffee. Yeah, yeah. Um... Just give you a, um, a brief sneak look. We think we've been all right, haven't we? Yeah. Hope so. Yeah. Let's do it. <laughs> there we go. So this box here came with the basket, the wicker basket, which is the main reason I bought that lot. Mm. But it also came with all this tat hunt. All this tat <laughs> Which I've now got to try and figure out how we're going to get rid of. Yeah, I know. So hopefully there's some money in it. Yeah, I'm Over sure the there back. is. There, hun, is the vintage. Um, Let's see if I can get over there. The vintage corn, you can do it. <laughs> Don't have your eye out with that. You need to come in as well oh, so yeah. people can hear you. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> they can still hear me, I'm loud. <laughs> Some brassware there with those vintage leather um, ice skates. Yeah. You've got your Yamaha doodle. Yamaha yeah, receivers is underneath there. But um, yeah, it comes with a few bits there. And then you've got your, yeah, that's the Marilyn Monroe stuff, which I'm keeping my fingers crossed about, hun. Yeah. I um, don't know, do you? Take a you chance. Don't know. We like collections, don't that's we? It, because yeah. they're normally quite collectible. Yeah. So that's pretty much what we got. Mm. Got to find somewhere for it to go now, haven't we? We have. <laughs> <laughs> so that's it for today's video. Yay, coffee time. It's Woo! coffee time. Also, yeah. it's a bit damp where I'm sat, hun. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. In wet bottoms. Wet bottoms. Um, <laughs> Yeah, what we'll probably do is, is uh, split it up probably into another two videos, maybe. Maybe, yeah. Um, yeah, and we'll, we'll go more, more in depth. Uh, what we don't want is this video to be, um, well, I really boring. Long, really. Yeah, exactly. Boring. <laughs> or more boring. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, so, yeah, so now we'll split it up. And, uh, yeah, in the next video, hopefully, we'll show um, two of the lots. Yeah, we're going to do a live sort of um it's not an unboxing not is live, it because it's not it? well it'd be live to us <laughs> yeah. we're gonna do it we're gonna do it live mm. like an unboxing so you can sort of see our reactions to all the amazing stuff we picked up yeah <laughs> mm. we'll see we'll see we'll see well, thank you very much for watching and um do give us a thumbs up if you enjoy these sorts of videos you know drop a comment down below it's getting windy now uh, it is getting windy actually yeah <laughs> get that coffee on <laughs> hopefully you can still still hear us and uh yeah please consider subscribing it is free oh thanks um, ever so much everyone for, yes. for all your support take care thank you see you next one see you next one